Hi guys, it's me. I'm actually in my room. Um, I was on vacation in Maine, October 18th through the 26th. <laughs> I don't remember when I went on vacation. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I got that, um, that I bought when I was on vacation. Some of the stuff, what, like, I bought food, um, like, obviously that, but, I mean, like, things I took home. So, like, there was this donut place that was really good, and I brought some donuts back for me and my mom. And then there was this restaurant that made their own barbecue sauce. So, I, ooh, sorry. So, like, I brought that home. And just, like, stuff like that. So, it's not... It's food, so it's not like I can show you. Sorry, I'm just trying to get like a good angle. I think that's good. Eh. Okay, that's better. Um, so, but um, I just want to show you a couple things. This things that I've I ordered when I had the hot cash or tour cash, whatever. Um, when I was away and just things that I bought so one of them I got why is this dirty I don't know why that's dirty oh whatever um I got an ashtray and then it says that's what I was looking at. I was like why is it dirty but whatever um it's an ashtray I got that and for myself I got this, it's a yellow jade. It's a little pendant that I can change out the amethyst. It's really pretty. It's sterling silver. I got that. Um, I did get something for my mom for her birthday. Um, this is for next year, this is in June. I was thinking, did I get her something else? So usually I get her stuff for Christmas, but I already got her a Christmas gift. It's a, a TV, but yeah. So this is, it's a amethyst and um, opal. The blue is the opal and amethyst ring. And it has two little, I think, cubic zirconia right there. I got her that. Um, I did get this for myself. It's these, I just put this in the same box for the video, but, um, there's these pearl earrings I got, which are really pretty. It has cubic zirconia around. It's sterling silver. It's the same place where I got this bracelet and this ring from where I got the jewelry from and it's a reasonably be reasonable price shop um I did get the this was 25 which is crazy for the size of it if you can kind of see for 25 dollars so this was a really good deal um but I do like the jewelry where I got this was in Algonquin and the to the earring and the ring for my mom. Um, the next thing I bought for myself was this coach bag. I've been using it. Um, my other coach bag that I have, it's the like leather strap here, but it's like connected like that. So when it goes over, it's breaking. So I wanted a bag that wouldn't, I would be able um, when I use it, I wouldn't have that issue. So I got the one with the chain and this was at the outlet. Um, it looks like that. And on the inside it has the pocket here. I have all my stuff already in it. It has like a, a suede or a microfiber, um, lining in it. Um, yeah, and I, and then I got this at the Dollar Tree because I wanted a little bag charm, but 
yeah so that was really what I got for myself um so these are the things that I ordered while I was on vacation some things I did buy in store um I have Elaine Bryant and Torrid um the first thing I I'm gonna show you I'm already using it is um the winter jacket this one's from Torrid this is the one that's the 10 degree 40 degree one um a 13 or whatever this is the one I mean like could because I live in Massachusetts I feel like when it's like five or zero degrees like I obviously gonna wear a sweater under it but like um, I don't know how well I had to get a, a new jacket because the one I got was a little tight in my stomach area and I did lose weight but then I regained it um, from like stress and like when you're um, upset about things you're not really taking care of like you're not taking care of yourself and not being like I'm just gonna eat whatever I want to eat and you're not you just want to do it because you want to eat something because you're not feeling you know you're not f you're feeling sad and you just want something to cheer you up and yeah but yeah, this jacket is really nice. I got a size one in it because usually I wear a size zero in the shirts. And if I did get a size two, it'd be too big in the arms and too big um, here. But if you like that, um, I like a little bit more fitted um, look, but it's not fitted where it looks tight or like, you know, that's too small. Um, so I did get that. Um, I figured how much I paid because I just put all the receipts. I'm just like, I'm just going to show it. Whatever. <laughs> so yeah, that's my jacket. It has, but yeah, it has two zi things, zippers here. It doesn't have two like thing, but it has, I don't know what these are called. I just know this whole thing is called a zipper. It just has like an extra one here. Um... And the hood is detachable. Um, the next thing, I'm just going to show it. I'm not going to be like, oh, this is all tour first and then I'll lean Brian. I'm just going to go and just grab because, yeah. I just wanted to show it. Um, I got this sweater. It's the army sweater. It still has the tags on it. I got this in a size zero. It's really stretchy. I would say if you wanted to do... Um, like a little bit oversized, I feel like I could have gotten a one and it would have fit loosely, but because I know, like, I was like, oh, if I don't like, you know, I can always return it in store. It's really stretchy. So, um, if you, with the size zero, if you keep it all the way unbuttoned, it's going to fit perfectly. If you button it all the way, it's going to be a little fitted. So if you want it loose all the way around, it's, um, I would go, like I would have gotten a size one in this, but then like I have the issue where it's too big in the arm and then it gets too long and then it's too big other, and I'm just like, no, because all I really want to wear under this is like a t-shirt and maybe a cami and that's it. Like, I don't want to wear like a long sleeve t-shirt. I don't want to do any of that. I just want to wear a cami and like a short sleeve and call it a day. <laughs> Um, this I got, I got two, I'll actually show both of the sweaters because they're both the same thing, but just two different colors. So the next sweater I got, um, this from Lane Bryant is from the outlet. So I was like, oh, I don't really know how this is going to look on. It's choice, but this is really cute. Um, I suggest if you go have an outlet near you excuse me, to go try it on. This is really stretchy too. Um, it's semi fitted because it's stretchy and it will go like, it adjusts to your shape, but then it's a little loose in the back, but it's not like, it's just right. Um, the sleeves are, they come about to your elbow. The only thing about this is it doesn't have it on the back, 
But I mean, I can wear like a cardigan or something like like a jacket that I can hide this and it would look fine. Like it looks really cute on. I know I feel like when you look at it on like on ta on the tape on screen, it doesn't look cute at all, but it's like it's really cute. Um, it's the same thing, but this one is a mustard color. And the same thing in the back. I know, I feel like lately I've been doing videos and my hair is like, I'm not dressed. Like, I'm always, I don't know. I am still not feeling 100%. Like, and I feel like I should be, but like, my, I feel like my hair is really fizz, frizzy. And I'm not like, when I do these videos, it should be put together and I'm not. And... I just, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't, like, I'm just like, I'm just going to do the video, and this is what I'm going to look like. <laughs> um, but, yeah, anyways, so the next couple things I got is some long sleeves because of some sweaters I have that I'm like, oh, and I, I'm like, where the hell am I going to get a long sleeve t-shirt? And I feel like they don't make them anymore. And I got them at the outlet. This is a Lane Bryant one. It's just a plain white. Um, the next one I did get is a black, but it has like a little lace trim. I feel like with these, because they're a little sheer, you can kind of see. You need a cami underneath, even though that's not the purpose. But like if you're just going to wear this by itself and not wear something underneath um it would be fine but like if you're gonna wear that and put something you would need a cami because then you'll see like your bra you'll see like the black bra and then like kind of your skin tone showing underneath that's not cute um i did get another one this one doesn't have this is like the white one it's just long sleeve black v-neck not the lace um this is another one. It has little buttons on the side. It has like little, oh, I thought it had ruching on the side here, but it's just like, it's a really thin sweater. Um, I'm trying to see how thin you can kind of see. It's like, I don't know. I feel like you can kind of get the gist of it. It's thin. Um, it's kind of see-through, but not really. Like, if I'm going like this and holding it up to the the thing, you can kind of see, like, the outline of things. But, um, with that, I'd probably wear, like, a different color cami underneath just to, like, have, like, like um, a layering piece. Same sweater. I, it's just gray, and it has the little buttons on the side I thought it was really cute like the outlet has you guys has been killing it and I haven't been there in a long time because the outlet um is really not near me but when we go to Maine we always go to the outlet um lately like the Lane Bryant um store that's in the mall that I can go to hasn't been having a lot of like I don't know what it is who's designing this stuff, but it's not being cute at all. And plus, I don't really need to buy clothes as much because I have, like, a, a uniform t-shirt, and then I can wear whatever pants I want to wear. So I bought these sweaters because, um, A, I gained weight, and I the sweaters I do have are smaller size, and I'm not going to fit into it, so I needed sweaters. Um, these, um, next things are from, also from Lane Bryant. It's just a cami, just a different color. It's like a beigey nude color. Um, same thing, just different color, like a, a peak, like a blush color. Um, this is also from Lane Bryant. It says, not today. I can either wear this to sleep or just wear it with some leggings, put a sweater over it, and 
because it's like it's cold the temperature now it's like 50 so but sometimes with the wind it's cold and like and i know other places 50 it's like it's warm but like we're by the coast so it's a little cooler um uh, it's it's just not I'm trying to give an example like it's some days when it says that it's 50 it feels like it's 40 degrees so it's like that um the last thing i got from lane bryant was i got this to go with um the long sleeve so I, f I figured i could do white or i could do black with this and then put like a belt um when it's like that when i'm going out for the day like if i'm doing errands in the morning and it's 50 and i have that and or like f almost 60 which is like kind of warm in, in the, around the fall and it has like a little the buttons on it like this is really cute and i tried it on i was like oh i tried it on an 1820 because I didn't have a 14, 16 and I was like certain things that I'm eating, like I'm planning on to go back to the gym and I kind of wanted to fit me. I didn't want it to get an 18, 20 and then it's way too big. Um, so this is going to fit me just right for now. And if, you know, so that's what it looks like. Um, the one thing that I, I have it down here and I hope the camera doesn't move. I didn't try these on. I did order um, some white skinny jeans because, and I haven't tried them on, and I need to try them on to see if they fit me, even though I know that they will. I've just been really lazy. I'm trying to get out of not being lazy. I'm trying to motivate myself to do things. Like, it took me forever. Like, today, I came back Friday the 26th. I already unpacked my suitcase, but, like, I haven't put any of my... The clean clothes I haven't even worn away. I put them in like a reusable bag. I haven't even put my suitcase and it's empty away. I just haven't been motivated for anything. And I don't know what it is, why I feel that way. And I've been trying to do things. So like like yesterday I went out um, after work with me, um, some, a lot, um, about six of my coworkers. We went out for like a lunch. Um, we talked and I was like, I kind of wanted to do what I wanted to do today. Um, what I did today, yesterday, so I could film and feel better, like, you know, do a nice video and do my hair. And I'm like, I really want to wash these clothes, but I want to show you guys what I got. And like on my date, like, I'm just like not feeling it. Like that show says not today. <laughs> That's what I feel like. But these are a 16 short. And I got a lot, of, was it the last time when I got the jeans, I got the ripped ones in a regular because I wasn't sure how long they were going to be. And I know that the shorts fit me, but then when I tried on the short of like these, they fit me right at the ankle, but the other ones I got were short, but then they felt like they scrunched up a little bit and I'm like, but they didn't do it this time. And I'm like, did they change the length? But I'm like, whatever. I'm like, if, if it's getting cold now, I can wear my Uggs and I can, you know, change into work shoes when I'm at work. Wear my sneakers at work so my cankles don't get cold. So I got these because I, when I worked at Motherhood, I had these white pants and they kept falling down on me. And I know they're maternity pants and I know there's like no belt loop, whatever, but they're supposed to stay up. But I got them an extra large, which is the size I wear. But I feel like I could have gotten a large, which sounds kind of crazy, because then they would have stayed up. But, like, they kept falling down, and I I had a outfit, and I was like, oh, my God, now I'm like, I really need a pair of white jeans. So when I do some, you know, have, I can wear it, but it's something that I'm not going to wear every day. It's just something that if I want to go out, like, on my day off or I have an, a party and I want to have a white pair of pants, I have them. And these are 16 short. And I haven't, like, legit, like, when I came back from vacation, I was, I haven't even tried them on. I'm, like, I'm bad. Like, I'm telling you guys, it's bad. Um, the next thing I got from Tord 
was the sweater um, hoodie. Um, my my plan is I could wear it with the long sleeve t-shirt or a cami underneath or just like a, just a regular tee and just wear it as a sweater. Um, it's really comfortable. A lot of the stuff I got is just really comfortable. It's really stretchy. Um, I feel like a lot of like this in the army one that I got, it's going to like pill, like the little limp balls. Um, if you, I, I have one of those sweater things that like it takes it off. So I'm okay. But those things are the best. They're the best. I use it for everything. Anything that has a pilling, like I use it and I love it. So the last thing I got from Torrid is I got these boots, as you can tell, it's shoes to replace ones that, um, that I had from the Avenue that the heel, like, cause it was flat and the heel part was like, it was like plat, not like rubber and it made a hole. And I'm like, okay, I know no one's going to see it. I'm just going to wear it, but I'm like, it's going to get bad because now that it's like winter, fall, I'm going to want to wear them. And I, I think I threw them out already, but I bought these. I was like, oh, these are super cute. And they are cute, but they feel more like velvety, but they they kind of look like it on film. And they have like, I thought online that they were like a full leather. And that's what I thought they were. But I don't know. I'm still debating if I want to return it, if I want to keep it. Because if it rains, that's the reason why I I wanted to have something where like if it rains, it doesn't like ruin like this this material I wanted it where if it started to snow or something that it would, would have been waterproof um but um I don't know like I have to make I know I have to make up my decision kind of quickly to see if I want to return them but I think I might keep them because it's a different material but I feel like if I wanted a different material I would have gotten them like that the tan camel color or whatever but um, they fit fine. It's not a fit issue. It's just more of the material of what I prefer. Um, I just feel like, like I get like they want this. And I know sometimes with these, like if you have them for a long time and then they like get dried out the elastic and then it breaks. I'm like so out of focus in this whole video, but whatever. I'm like, I, I don't have the patience, but I've had that experience with things like that, but it doesn't really get that bad. But I know sometimes little details like that irritate me, but I'm just like, whatever, like, what am I going to do? Um, but yeah, that's pretty much what I got. Um, I hope that I can find ones that are like that, like. I'm really debating this because it's not what I want. Like, I know I'll wear them, but I know it's not what I really want. Would I rather return it and then find, like, they make something that I really want and then I rebuy it? So that's what I'm debating on doing. But I don't know, like, they, it might take, like, a couple of years for, for them to make it because, like, who knows? Like, who knows when I'm going to get another gray, gray beard? gray bear gray pair of boots like it's just annoying <laughs> i feel so like i don't know but you guys know what i'm talking about and taz is in the bed with me but i'll lay down i was watching tv and i'm like you know what it's getting bright let me do this video real quick um i'm trying to think if there was anything else that i got that um Oh, I got a candle, but I'm like, I don't want to go get it. I did get a candle. I went to I went to the thrift store. I did get a candle for five dollars. Um, I went a couple years ago thrifting, and it's not like how it is where I live. They're like it's kind of where in Maine. It's a little bit remote. Um, it's not uh like it's it's popular. Like there's people who obviously live there. Like it's a it's just that, like, it's spread out, 
and um, Maine is more laid back, so it's not like what the things I'm looking for to resell. It's not there. Um, so, but, you know, I do look because there's some like vintage things, like maybe old Barbies, like My Little Ponies, stuff like that. But um, it's really hard to find like, like a Michael Kors or like some kind of like Burberry or, or anything like that. Like, I feel like if people who would buy things like that, they would be more in the city, more like on the outskirts of around the city. Um... Yeah, I did go to, I went to Lush. I got some bath bombs. Um, what else? I, I didn't even think about it. I was just like, ah, eh, whatever. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's, I didn't really like, it was just more relaxing. That was really about it that I got that I um, wanted to show you. My leg is cramping up. Oh my God. <laughs> sit in that position for a while but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me um let me know like what you think of Tord and like brian or if there's anything that you want to comment about or whatever um i'm gonna try to get back to like and i know i was saying that it's just i don't know what like i'm just in a funk and i'm trying to like get back to what I feel like more <coughs> excuse me more how like one feeling more motivated to do things because I haven't been wanting to do a lot of eBay like I like like I have my stuff I still sell my things on eBay it's just more of going out and sourcing for things I'm just like I'm not feeling it I don't want to do it but I do, I do once in a while go, um, thrifting. It's just that I also have a lot of things that I'm trying to, you know, sell, you know, I've been doing some, um, Buffalo exchange or, um, uh, what's it called? Just like, well, they buy you clothes and they give you money, um, or whatever and things like that to get rid of things. Um, so I can find items to resell oh that's part of the i was like what is that it was part of the, the tag um what the hell is this i don't know i don't know what this is but <laughs> yeah that's about it i think i there was a some kind of bug or something from the clothes nothing i don't have bugs and like um, it's just something from when I went away, um, because I haven't touched <laughs> anything. I seriously haven't. I think it was just something that when I went away in the car or whatever. But yeah, um, because I just literally just <laughs> put all this stuff over here, and this is my cat. <laughs> she decides to come by. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Bye.